Hey, Daniel. We were talking about shake and bake before. Yeah. I think shake and bake. By the way, shake and bake is on. Oh yeah, on, on this channel yesterday. He called and he acted like a real ignorant person. Just telling like it is. A little bit worse than that. A little bit worse than that. Yeah, I think he's worse than a wild animal, the way he was speaking on the phone. Yeah, this is nice. the guy who had a seizure in the back of my truck uh, 45 minutes into a ride-along for the day. Um, needless to say, he went out in an ambulance. Maybe. Or maybe meth. But, take a look at all his pecs. <laughs> what is up with all this pec? I think... Shake and Bake put this together because it's such a shitty job. It really is. And you're going to like this, by the way. The intro of this, well, immediately after the intro of this video, I am doing something for the first time we've never done before. December 1st, 2022. It's December already, Peter. Excited. You excited? So. You like Christmas? Christmas! You know, St. Mike has to come and give some gifts soon. Yeah. yeah. Ho, ho, ho! Uh, St. Mike's gonna have to, they have to come through with some gifts. We're talking about cash gifts. Cash, something like good old greenbacks. All right. This morning, we're heading to a service call in Lido Beach, which is next to Long Beach, the Barrier Island in Nassau County on Long Island. We're taking out an inadequate Badaris by Bosch. Oh, indirect fired water heater and installing a Takagi tankless. That's right, we're ripping out a Bosch Badaris and we're putting in a Japanese Takagi. Stay tuned. There's always a first on this channel. Well, let's get going and make sure you smash that thumbs up button and please consider subscribing to the channel. There's no cost or obligation and you'll help us get that much closer to 100,000 subscribers and the goal is by June 1st, 2023. That's the goal. You know, Definitely. people are saying, Mike, it's gonna probably take about a year, year and a half, maybe two years. No, ladies and gentlemen, we can do it in six months. Just smash that thumbs up button and then hit that subscribe button. Let me get your thoughts and feedback in the comment section down below of what you think about Takagi. You ready? Pull up your pants, get your belt on, tie your shoes, because your shoes aren't going to get wet like mine is today, that's for sure. All right, here's that Badaris GB142. And here is the Indirect. It's a 52 capacity there, but we are running out of hot water and she's not stable. See, it wobbles a little bit. So we're gonna uh, take care of that. We're gonna put a tankless on the wall right here. I'm gonna move this piece of plywood out of the way. Well, maybe we'll put it on that wall. I'm gonna vent through the ceiling across to outside. Um, should be easy peasy, easy peasy. See the venting they did in the fresh air that took on the three inch here. That's okay. But uh, yeah, not too shabby. Not too shabby. Let's get rocking and rolling. Ooh, what do we have here? A little bit of a drip from there. Hitting that and then the air separator below. We're gonna have to uh, address this. Okay. But before I get started, I wanna give a quick shout out to the people at Brunt. Not only do they make these excellent boots, they make great pants. Look at these pants, by the way. They are so much comfortable than the red caps I have. Look at these, great pants. Look at this, really, really nice. It feels nice. 
I feel like I could make a million dollars today wearing these pants. I really do. Check them out. And I'm going to give away two pairs. If you're a size 36 by 32 in inseam, I'm going to send you a pair. All right. Um, just send me an email, Mike at MikeyPipes.com. The first two to send me an email. Hey, Mike, let me try a pair of those pants. I got 36 by 32 available for you. If you were interested in getting some of these, I think they're giving a 15 or 20% off or 10% off. I'll put a link in the description box down below. Check them out. Brunt, they make great boots. They're really, really comfortable. Steel toe, really, really nice tits boots. And the pants, wow, they perfectly complement the nice new uniforms. Check them out. All right, we're starting to pump down. I got my Milwaukee M18 transfer pump. With a, a drain at the bottom. I the relief valve was open. Peter, Peter Piper. All right, I have my from boiler isolated off there. And here is the other side. We have a, a line voltage low with a cutoff there. We're gonna have to re uh, put that in somewhere else. And I have valve closed there as well. So it's good that this leak has been going dripping there as you just saw. So we're gonna have to do something with that spiral vent there. That's not gonna be easy to fix. We're coming out of this hydraulic separator right here. Uh, all in black pipe. That is not gonna be able to spin on easy. That is not an easy repair right there, ladies and gentlemen. It for sure is not. And what is up with this expansion tank? What's up with this PEX? To the automatic feed out uh, of the oh. Wow. I've, I've seen a lot of crazy shit in my days, but I think this thing takes the cake. We have expansion packs to copper, to expansion packs to black. Maybe they didn't have, they were pecs, pecs, pecs in a way? <laughs> oh, hey, 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 pecs away. Are they stupid or something? Yes. There's an expansion tank. Forget about that. Is it pregnant? Expansion pack, is it pregnant? No. Wow, it's a Wolverine grass. Wow. But it's made in China. Wolverine grass. Hydronic system expansion tank. I didn't know Wolverine grass made expansion tanks. But check this out. Um, black with the brass adapter. Going to a half inch expansion, expansion packs. Held together with some zip ties. Orange. I bet you it's a Wolverine grass zip tie. <laughs> Going up. We have our Tayco half inch pressure reducing valve. We have a backflow prevention device, copper, back to expansion packs. Wow. There's a sale on expansion packs. Let's take a look at this mess that they did. Look at this. They just. Maybe Shake and Bake put this together. What do you think? <laughs> you have to be like shaking like a seizure to be putting pipe in like this. That's for sure. Damn. Smash that thumbs up. We're in your service uh, territory. We're in Basin Valley Street, New York. Give us a call, 516-348-6300. And don't forget our goal. What's the goal, Peter? 100,000 100, subscribers by June 1st, 2023. That's six months from away. No, May 1st. You know what? Let's make it seven months. No, six months. Six months. May 1st, 2023. We need another 49,920 subscribers to hit 100,000 subscribers. That's going to be epic. Please be kind and subscribe. Because if you don't, I'm going to have Peter punch me in the nose. Do it now. Hi, Daniel. We were talking about Shake and Bake before. Yeah. I think Shake and Bake... By the way, Shake and Bake is on, oh yeah, on, on this channel yesterday. He called and he acted like a real ignorant person. Just kind of like it is. A little bit worse than A little bit worse than that. Yeah, I think he's worse than a wild animal, the way he was speaking on the phone. Yeah, this is the guy who had a seizure in the back of my truck uh, 45 minutes into a ride-along for the day. Um, needless to say, he went out in an ambulance. Maybe, or maybe meth. But, take a look at all this pecs. Yeah. <laughs> what is up with all this pecs? I think 
Shake and Bake put this together because it's such a shitty job. It really is. And you're going to like this, by the way. The intro of this, well, immediately after the intro of this video, I am doing something for the first time we've never done before. You want to take a guess? Talking bad about Bosch. Uh, that, no, that's, that's your channel. <laughs> no, we're taking out a Bosch Padaris indirect water heater that's made in Witzlar, Germany. And we're putting in a Takagi tankless condensing water heater. Have you never put in a Takagi? No, I've never taken out a Bosch Padaris <laughs> and replaced it with a competitor. And I want to say Bosch, I'm not even saying it's a competitor. Well, actually, it is. Bosch makes the green therm tankless, the T9900i. So does Takagi. But no. I just want to show the community that Mikey Pipes and Pipe Doctor were an equal opportunity installer. All right? And yes, while I love Bosch, Daniel hates him. He does. He really hates Bosch. And I don't blame him. And you should just check out his channel, DCHVAC, for reasons why he hates Bosch so much. It's, it's pathetic. It really is. And Bosch, if you're listening, pick up the phone, call me. You have my number. What was I going to say? Competitor. Oh, yeah. But we're putting in a Takagi. And you're going to smash that thumbs up button. You're going to subscribe because by May 1st, we need 100,000 subscribers. Do it now. Back to business. We have a mission. See this three-inch PVC? Yes. All right. You know where that goes? Outside. Yes. Let me show you where it goes. We're going to go up here. All right? We have a closet here. We have this. And it terminates right there. <laughs> What's up with that? Oh, we're going to need a lot of 90s there. No, why? A lot of 90s. So we're going to go the same way, right? The plane, the plane. On final approach. Oh, look, the landing layer just came down. We're gonna make it happen. All right. Look at what we found. Oh, press Should I didn't pull out of Peter's pocket? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. It's not even Vega though. Some cheap brand. It looks like that Zoom Lock Max, by the way. You know the Zoom Lock Max? Yeah. Yeah. Our lock it would probably leak. They've been sitting there forever, 10 years. Maybe the contractors who put this in thought they were in uh, New York City because this is the second low water cutoff. There's one on inside the GBH, the GB142. Oh, yeah, it's right on the side of the manifold. Um, but this is, it's good because it kills everything. We're eliminating the line voltage low water cutoff because we have a low voltage low water cutoff inside the Bedaris. We're repurposing the box right there. We're gonna add a outlet. Right now, Daniel is working on bringing in line voltage to it from the switch. Then we're gonna put a, an outlet there and wire in, pigtail in the power to the relay and power to the Bedaris. Right here, well right here, that's gonna go our Takagi condensing uh, water heater. It's gonna be really nice. It's gonna come out really tits job, can't wait. Uh, it's crooked. It it yeah, we are. We actually can. We're going to take that off and put a. Uh, yeah. How's that torpedo? Look? Okay. Uh, okay. Let's secure that bad boy. Let's secure her to the wall. Peter, that's what we're going to do. Once he's done with that, I'm going to get some pipe for you. We're going to run some pipe. Some pip. 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 You know what it's going to be? It's going to be a private label. A pipe doctor, Takagi. <laughs> Actually, that's a great idea. Daniel. You want to make your own water heaters now? No, I'm just going to buy Takagi's and put Mikey Pipes raised dome stickers on them from Armor Decal from Ontario, Canada. You see that everything you put in. I should. Imagine I could just like relabel a, a Bosch and call it a Mikey Pipe special. No. No? What, Green Star? No, you like the IDS's. So far. So far. You haven't had the service one yet. 
That green, that was, it was a green star, right? It was a green star 151? Which, yesterday's? The con no, the combi. Which the one? Bosch combi that you worked on the day before Thanksgiving. Yeah, that was a green star, yeah. And that was what? Well, that, that was a disaster. Yeah. Disaster. And there's details on Daniel's uh, YouTube channel, DC HVAC. Check it out. It's not going anywhere. Wouldn't it be messed up if I put it on crooked? Is it... At its level. There it is. Look at that. Oh, it's close. close. Hold on, hold on. Is it really oh, wait, crooked? Maybe the level's a little maybe. bent. Yeah, it looks good. No, move out of the way. Move it out of the, no, move the level out of the way. What? Move the level out of the way. <laughs> Oh man, it does look a little hair crooked. It is crooked. It's off by a C hair. But it's nice. You can you can push these. Like if you push it, it'll move. <sighs> okay. There it is. Ooh, look at that baby. I bet you Roger Wakefield doesn't have this. Lead AP. I don't watch him. I don't know. Roger Wakefield? I know of him. This guy Roger Wakefield is a YouTube quote unquote plumber. But he sits out like in a studio and just like talks about That's the toilet pictures. Guy. Yeah, the toilet guy. Which I'm, I'm gonna make my own how to fix a running toilet video. I am. Catch it. Yeah. <laughs> Catch it. <laughs> He's got like half a million subscribers. And I look at his views. A couple thousand views per, per, uh, per video. That's it. That makes no sense. Yeah. Really makes no sense. All right, let's get to work on this Takagi. Make sure you smash that thumbs up button. Make sure you subscribe. And if you want a magical pipe wrench next to your name, like Daniel has, you have one too. And I think a hundred other people have magical pipe wrenches next to their name when you comment. Um, smash that dollar sign. Do it now. Your, con your contribution for as little as a dollar will earn you a magical pipe wrench. It's very nice. 10, 30, Series 6? 1036. It looks like the, the Pepsi Rolex watch face. Looks cool. Yeah, it does look cool like that. Uh, I went to the supply house to get some more 4-inch, 3-inch, I'm sorry. And Daniel did the copper. Look at that. Very nice. Everything's pressed in? Yep. Very nice. Got the Webstone tankless isolation valves. Press. We have our temperature and pressure relief valve right there. Very nice. It'll plug into that outlet right there. And we are going to extend that three inch. We're gonna cut open the ceiling here a little bit, come up from here, and then we're gonna run our fresh air, which we're gonna be very tight for space, but we'll make it happen. Ain't that right, Peter? Definitely. All from our private labeled tankless water heater. <laughs> awesome. Okay, there it is. Nice, pretty, nice. Beautiful job we did here. We took the gas piping from there, which is good because we have one inch above. We're good with the gas, fresh air, exhaust, really, really nice. And uh, we have endless hot water. Let's crank up the temperature a little bit. Uh, why does not want to do it? <laughs> Making a fool out of me now. Maybe up and down together. <laughs> All right, we'll have to read the manual. <laughs> That's a blooper.